Geek to Knights West popping it's Adonis. We are back for another reaction. Today we're starting with Tower of God. Bro, what? Nah. My meal is my meal. None of your meal. And before we get into it, huge shout out to our sponsor, Footmouse. Introducing a revolution in gaming. Footmouse, the first science-based gaming mouse made for feet. I've been using Footmouse for over six months. My APM is over 520, my KDA has doubled, and my win rate's up. I'm playing with my hands, my feet, my whole entire body is focused on wins. Since I've started, I've completely stopped feeding. Footmouse. And Footmouse is brought to you by Raid Shadow Legends. And because sponsorception is a thing, we are also sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. Bro. Oh, my bad. Now, if you haven't heard of Raid Shadow Legends, it's an amazing mobile game for iOS and Android, which is free to play and available on PC. But because we're on quarantine right now, they're like, hey, we're gonna sprinkle in a little dash of awesomeness. Now, one of these awesome things are the daily rewards. They were 90 days, now they're 180 days. So that means every day you can get free energy refills, you can get free silver, free gems, free shards. Bro, you can get free all types of stuff. And to top that off, you get a free barbarian legendary champion. She's legendary. Now, I'm not really a mobile game player, but I started playing this a couple days ago, and I'm telling you, it's mad addictive. And it's not a difficult game to get good at. So I was like, oh, I'm in because I'm not an expert. So find me on there, Nougat Prime. You know what to do. So if you want to secure your bag in the game of 200K and a free champion, click the link in the description. It's only active for 30 days. It'll be in your inbox in the game. So go get the bag, I'll see you there. Now, as usual, welcome to all the new Geek Denies that have been knighted over the past 24 hours, man. Welcome, we are on our way to 300K with that first goal of 150K in the sights. Bang, so if you guys haven't subscribed, man, you haven't joined the wave, joined the movement through this anime community we're building here, we would love to have you smash that subscribe button. Also, if you guys missed the ass for Tower of Gods, what is the ass you say? It's the after show show that me and Toshi do over my Instagram for Tower of Gods, for Black Clover. We will be adding it for Boruto once I get caught up, just so you know. Just so you know, essentially any current anime that I'm watching will be doing a live talk show with Toshi over on Instagram Live. So make sure you guys follow us over there. But uh, other than that, oh, also uh, the anime tournament is still coming. I know I've been talking to you guys about this for a couple of weeks now. Make sure you guys follow us over there. This video should be coming out on this channel very soon. So make sure you guys hit that notification bell on this channel so you don't miss the you know how to on this anime tournament video. It's gonna be super dope. 32 animes, we're looking for the best first season of an anime. So if you guys don't want to miss that, you want to partake, make sure you guys follow here and follow us over on Instagram so you don't miss that video. Outside of that, man, I'm excited. Tower of God, brand new anime for me to consume and, you know, be along the journey with the people that are watching it currently. Very excited about that. So without further ado, man, let's get into this. I am super hyped about watching a new anime that is current. I haven't been able to be in the fandom on a current anime, man, in a really long time. So it's going to be cool to be with everybody on this journey. But without further ado, let's get this party started, baby. <laughs> She got, she like me, she got, she got shoe shoes. Not money and riches, money and bitches. She said, I'm climbing the tower. What the fuck? Does that meta a metaphor? Or what? The white steel eel in the ball. Test one. So I'm assuming he's climbing the tower because he wants her. That's what I'm assuming. I'm just trying to figure out at what point, like why, where is this tower? Because it's like he was literally just 
in a cave and the ground open, but then it showed it on a vertical as if he was at the top of the tower. Like, I'm very confused on the visual representation at the moment. Marvelous. Oh. That was pretty cool. That was an interesting take on some animation. Oh, this is tight. I didn't even catch that. Let me go back. Let me go back. Hold on. She said something. I was reading the top part. <laughs> <laughs> what are you stupid? <laughs> so I'm assuming what he's about to give him is gonna allow him to understand what the fuck they're saying. It's almost like a transetting. He doesn't understand us. <laughs> I don't know who you are, but I consider it. <laughs> <laughs> mm. <laughs> I'll let you borrow this if you got a cute face. <laughs> okay, so he won't be able to cut him, so he's going to have to cut him from the inside. <laughs> yep. I can't answer that. What's going on? Oh, what? Mm, okay, that was actually a really interesting transition. So 
as he's stabbing, those slits transition to him being trapped in something. And those slits, those same type of slits have light coming through. She rescues him. So this is a flashback, obviously. But that's actually a very clever way of using what he was doing to transition back to a flashback. <laughs> Hold on, what? First of all, so this is like a Zompak Toe low key? What? This is interesting, bro. What? Boy. Ah, since you have such a cute face, I shall grant you my strength just as once. What? <laughs> <laughs> Facts, that's real shit. He's like, this shit, we need something interesting in life, bro. This is, we don't want this boring shit. <laughs> Oh, chill. Damn. I'm so confused. I'm so confused. So at each level, does each person have a different thing that they have to pass? Because that creature, he just killed. But to get to the next level, they have to break the orb to go to the next level. So I'm confused. I'm just, I'm confused on... What's going on right now? You know what I'm saying? Oh, he a little agile. Okay. Oh. Your whole body is his foot, bro. That's bad. <laughs> Snipey snipe. Oh, <laughs> oh, that was tight. Yeah, this guy is tight. You know what I like about this already? It looks like it's drawn. It doesn't look like it's it's done on a digital situation. It looks like pencil drawings, which I actually like this art style. Yo, this is interesting. This is interesting, bro. All right, let's go to this next episode. I'm on a time crunch. I just want to make sure I get through some of these, some of these things, bruh. Yeah. 
I wonder how much that'll be worth. What? <laughs> Wraith Razor. <laughs> I'm too curious. He's like, hold on, bro. I need to see what the hell is going to go down. <laughs> hey. Damn. Oh. Tight. Oh, that was fire. Right. <laughs> 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 Well, something's gonna happen to him because he's trying to attack him right now. Oh, <laughs> Sorry about it. Now you're on the squad. <laughs> He's like, what the hell is this? Oh yeah, that's bomb. Give me some more of that. <laughs> でも、俺を仲間にしたことを感謝するんだな。うわ、うわ。まあ、あっという間に喧嘩が収まりました。まさか乱歌面白いのか。乱歌って何ですか？乱歌ってのは塔の頂上まで登ったすごいやつ。あ
選別者の中でもほんの一握りの常識を超えた怪物たちあの人たちすごい人たちだったんだな思ったよりも通過者が多いのでちょっと間引かせてもらいますね間引き Oh, chill. Oh, chill. Yo, this dude was completely unaffected, bro. Uh, he's like, what's, what's wrapped up in there? Oh. ブラー。聞き分けです。はい。うん。ですが、ランカー相手に引き分けとは、やるさんの質問にお答えしましょう。本当ですか。あなたのようなテレベルな人間がいるから、こんなテストが必要なのに。いいの。この塔は私のような選
So it's got to be a focus thing. It's got to be like a, a willingness. It's got to have something to do with that determination, focus, your why. It's got to have something to do with that shit, bro. Who is this black? Uh huh, bro. This shit is tight, bro. I. I'm with this already, bro. This is super interesting. This is actually really interesting to me right now, man. A girl. Mm. this is interesting so his his why is again there's a reason why something's going on obviously with his family being exiled for something so this is interesting his his why is is on another level you know what i'm saying he's determined he has things that that he values why he's trying to do what he's doing right now in the same way that bam does this is interesting <laughs> ソラ。あ、ソラ。あ、ソラ。あ、ソラ。あ、ソラ。あ、ソラ。あ、ソラ。あ、ソラ。あ、ソラ。あ、ソラ。あ、ソラ。あ、ソラ。あ、ソラ
5分以内に扉を開けることだ。にも行動できない。だったらなんだ世界は君の確信を待ってくれない。君には躊躇なく扉を開けてしまう。You gotta take action, bro! What? それに。あの、母さん。疑う心を知らぬその瞳を守りたくはないか。うーん。Bruh, go back. You hear what he said? Do what you want to protect those eyes which don't know doubt. Don't you want to protect those eyes which don't know doubt? Bro, what? Come on, my guy. He's asking him a question right now, bro. He's like, look, man, like you got people around you, bro, that aren't doubtful like you are. You know what I'm saying? Like. Oh, that's crazy. So my guy was a my dude was a plant. He's like, look, I need you to tell everybody, look, this is what the this is what the secret is. Ooh, what's this, bro? What's the test? Mm. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> no, bro. She ate it, bro. Yo. Oof. Ooh, it is her. Get off, Black Turtle. <laughs> he knows it's her, bro. Yup. Yup. Oh, chill, bro. This shit. Okay. I get it. I get it. This show is fire, bro. This show is fire. I dig it a lot. The idea of the test right now, like right off the top, the... The tests are super interesting. It's testing certain attributes of people. Like, essentially trying to see, like, you know, how how strong is your will? So at least is what it seems like at the moment, right? It's testing your perseverance, obviously your ability to, to handle certain pressure, obviously your skill set, your power. Um, but a lot of it, it's, it really is, it's like goal-oriented, which is, at least for what I'm looking at at the moment, is very dope. I love goal setting and, and going after those things, right? So in this scenario, obviously the goal is to get to the top of the tower. So they're like trying to weed out people that do not have it. Like they do not have the perseverance to drive, to go, because it's gonna be a serious situation for them. They're like, look, you, you can't be weak doing this. There's no, we have no room for weakness here. The, we need people that are that are trying to climb this, that have 
you know, the will, the perseverance, the, the, the drive to just push to like, okay, we got a challenge. We gotta, we have to figure this out. Like there is no other option. It's either this or die. Like we gotta go. That at least is what it seems like at the moment. If that's the, the concept of these tests to kind of get them to that, that point to see who's, who's actually ready to, to go up the tower, bro. I just think it's so tight. I just think the idea of the show so far is dope. Um, Bam as a character, super interesting. The irregular vibes, I'm digging quite a bit uh, with the regulars. The world that they're trying to build, like, how they explain, like, you have the outer, you have the inner, and then you have, uh, I forgot what the other part is, but essentially um, everything revolves around this tower, which is super dope. So he doesn't know about the tower really at all. He didn't really know about the sky. He didn't know about a lot. So it's like, yo, where are you coming from, right? He was, it seems like under something and, you know, Rachel saved him from something. We don't know what that is. He's obviously from somewhere that isn't where everybody else is from. So this big question mark now that's looming for me is like, okay, is he from this, some kind of outer realm that grants him as an irregular? You know what I'm saying? What's what's his ability? Why did the sword pick him, right? Just because he's cute? I don't know. Like, there's got to be some tie-ins to why the sword lady, the, <laughs> the chick uh, inside the sword is like, you know what? I'll grant you my power. Cool. We're good. Like, there, there's a lot of questions right now that I'm actually super excited about. Um, I'm probably going to watch uh, this again before... Um, the the uh after show show for this so if you guys haven't seen the after show show me and toshi do live after shows for the current animes that i'm watching current meaning that are airing at the moment weekly um so at the moment we just did black clover this is be the second one i might be doing a boruto one and possibly a one piece one not 100 percent sure yet on one piece but i may be doing another one as well um so uh, make sure you guys follow me and Toshi over on Instagram because that's where the live shows are taking place over on Instagram afterwards. So this one, even though it's airing on Friday, uh, just so you guys are aware, it aired yesterday morning. So just giving you guys a heads up, the after shows are going to happen right after the episodes air and then the reactions will happen afterwards. So you may get some of my thoughts on the, you know, the talking points, stuff like that of the show, but my reactions are obviously going to stay here uh, when I'm seeing stuff and my, you know, my uh, breakdowns of stuff like that and me, me and Toshi having dialogue on those things. So uh, I would say follow us over there um, so you guys don't miss those things. You guys can chime in on the live as well and have you know, questions, Q&A and all that stuff on the episodes as we're watching this live uh, every week. Um, so yeah, let me know your guys' thoughts on these three episodes though. Obviously next week will be just the one episode, but let me know your guys' thoughts on Tower of God so far. Are you enjoying it? What's your favorite character so far? Let me know in the comments down below. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button so you guys don't miss another Tower of God reaction. I upload damn near daily. So if you guys wanna catch other reactions, this is the channel to be at. And also, if you want to check out my previous reactions, that link will be right to the side. All right, guys. Till next time. Stay geeked.